I knew I saw it. I knew I saw it. I'm not crazy. Okay. Uh, can I level? Not quite yet. I need 9k more. But, Ashes of War... What can I put this on? That I mean, I could put it on this. Right? Yes, I can. Uh, I can't put Frost on it because it is a Poison Ash. So it doesn't have affinity with that. Uh, I actually have a better quality. No, Keen, because the base goes higher. Yeah. So I could make it Keen. Poison would probably have the most synergy, though, but I do not have Arcane Scaling. Because, again, it works with Poison, so I would want it to inflict Poison. And then I detonate it with this kick. Alright, let's see this. It's a rider kick. With a cool spin flourish. Oh, I would I still hit the ground. Hang on. Oh, it doesn't let me go off edges. That's actually pretty handy. But yeah, that is That is a rider kick. That's cool. I would need to spec into Arcane for that, which is a little sad for me, because Arcane is a thing I'm not specced in. And again, when it comes to requirements, the only thing that suddenly have requirements are now the, um... Bale weapons. So... They're not weapons. Bale spells. So it's not like I really still have a use for Arcane. Especially when I need to pump it to unbelievable levels. And I've, again, I've stated before, the previous highest requirement, like, minimum requirements for arcane weaponry and stuff, was 23. And I want to say it was... Was it Eleanor's pole blade, or was it something else? 19... Uh, 20. What was it that needed arcane? No, something weirdly arcane. Oh, it may have been Marais Executioner's Sword? 23, yes. Yes, this was the highest arcane requirement in the base game. And suddenly Bill is like, hey, do you have 60? Rune Bear. Oh boy. You close that gap real fast. Excuse me. I'm sorry. I picked the wrong fight. Not my hook. There we go. The light faded, but the point did not. Dragon. All right, you know what? That works. That works very well. Dragon Maw is good stuff. They fly now. Those are Scorpiders. And they fly now. What if I don't want to? Why do they have to fly now? That seems highly unnecessary. Hey, you're just critters, right? You're not smaller bears. Oh, what is your hitbox? Are you kidding me?
Ow. Wow, really? I was still getting up. Your hitbox is a ridiculous rune bear. And I can't hit you, apparently. Sit down and shut up. I don't like fighting you. Nope, that was the wrong move entirely. I'm on top of you. On top of this rock. I don't know what that rock is. Oh my god. That attack has startup, but the timing is weird. Oh, you swing wide. Just drag them all. It's a solution to everything right now. Except when it misses. What did you drop? Just blood and bone. What am I standing on here? Is... Is this dung? Oh, it is. I don't want to offer to the dung god. Well, what would I want that? Oh, I, I'm sorry. I hit a boar. Now he's mad. Alright, that was my bad. But now you have to die. Okay. I don't want to go down to the Scorpiders. Can I just not? They're probably just as dangerous as the regular ones, as in not terribly, but I just don't want to deal with that. What are you? Oh, bear. You've noticed. What is your hitbox? No. I will not let you. I'm out of stamina. But you're out of stance. Ow. I'm also out of stamina again. I hate that move so much. Oh, there you go. That one gave me some drinks back. That's good. Alright. There's a lot of rune bears. At least I can handle rune bears now, but... Boy, do I not want to handle rune bears. Oh, I was just saying... What if you don't know? He knows. How did I miss? No. There we go. Hi, I'm out of stamina. That's bad. Still bad. Got you in the hand. Get this repost this time. Oh, 
Well, that didn't go as well as I'd like. Alright, that's the most amount of rune bears I've had to fight in a row, and, uh... No thank you. Oh, are you another red one? Ooh, leather headband, glory to tire, leather arm wraps, leather leg wraps. I mean... Here we go, I guess. Hello, bear. Rugaila. Rugal? Ow. Oh, right, you do that. Rugal bear. Is it Omega Rugal? I was out of that, excuse me. You spawned stones underneath me. How did you close that distance so fast? How am I unable to hit you? Oh my god, every time. I forget you do that. Can I get a knockdown on you? No, apparently not. I'm out. I was getting up. There's a stake around here, right? Because I came quite a... Oh, no, right, never mind. There's no stake. Uh, Torrent, let's go. We have a bear to find. I can't believe that they didn't put a stake there after all of the rune bears. There's so many rune bears. And yeah, I was like... Getting flasks back? But, hey, it wasn't enough. Let me get Golden Vow ready. Rugayala. You are a big bear. Oh, you're sat right next to my stuff. Also, let's go real, yeah? Pressure up. That's what I'm looking for. Get in there. Oops. What if I said no? Alright, bear defeated. Roar of Rugalea. Rugalea. Rugal bear. The incantation of what is jokingly called the Bear Communion channels the power of Rugalea, the red the great red bear. Transform itself into a great red bear and emit a mighty roar. Ah, so what the bear does to me. 
and it hurts a lot. An incantation that is more akin to divine invocation of the horn scent than it is uh, to the dragon communion. Only through desperate battle with feral wild can one discover a god unique to oneself. Oh, that's crazy. So it becomes a quote-unquote bear communion because the bear is so revered, it is basically a god. And therefore you can channel its power. God bear. I could have tried sleep now, couldn't I? Bravery required. Something was required. Alright, can I shoot these guys down? Oh man, you're even like large ones too. They don't need to fly. Wow, just missed, huh? Can my swords like do anything? Okay, they are still weak. But I wish glint blades worked in the DLC. Because they seem to not lock on to so many things. Ow. There's been plenty of things in this DLC where it's like they just won't... I get close... Oh, now they fire. Hit it. Thank you. But yeah, like some bosses where it's just like... Hey, I would like to shoot it down. Why would you not shoot it down? Thank you. Just don't touch it. <laughs> Lured it into the sword. Just going around. Uh, I did think there was a little alcove in here. I can probably go under that, so let's see. Trying to read the hints that the map are putting down. Except there's flying scorpiders, and I hate it. I think they're just spider scorpions, but scorpiders works for me. They probably don't need to be charged. Let's see if just two regular will do it. Ow. Shouldn't have rolled backwards. Two is not enough, actually. At least one needs to be... Ow. Charged. I know you're up there. Excuse me. No. No cheating. Not the bird... Oh, they both need to be charged. Where are you shooting? Okay, I probably need to go around to get up, yeah? Kind of? You guys are sort of just up here, huh? I hear another one stomping around. Oh, there's a catacomb over here. I can hear... I Not here. I can see the statue, guys. Oh, it was a boar. That's what it was. Yeah, these guys indicate catacomb this way. Be wary of group. There's going to be more of them over there before I can get in the catacomb. Oh. Oh! Militiamen. Yeah, that makes sense. Get out of the way, Ghost Livewort. Alright, we'll just keep missing, it's fine. There we go. That's what it meant. In case anyone else wants to show up. Hello. Stop. Avert your gaze from me. I beg, look away! Arrgh! 
I'm gonna stare at you harder now. Well, there go my swords. Because they're all gonna break against this door as I push through. Oh no! Oh, never mind. I'm gonna say, see? It didn't. But, but then it did. Scorpion River Catacombs. Oh. Well, that makes sense why it's called that. And down we go. Oh, there was no uh, opening there. Hey, so what, is, what are the chances of some below this one? Huh. I feel like they haven't really done that all DLC. Like, they've had the spike ceiling traps, but not, like, under elevator zones. Though, now that I'm in these catacombs, I'm remembering that in the other catacombs, uh, there are both things that I missed and forgot about. Yeah? Bring it. I'm just gonna rush you. Is the wall a liar? The wall's not a liar. Wow, the, the one guy dropped down and it's like, is he gonna shoot or not? Then gonna be another one. Ow, you have a projectile. What is that over there? Oh, it's like a super creepy basilisk statue. I hate it. It's always an enemy head. That's why I have glint blades. Rejuvenating bolses. Oh, good. That means death blight. That always means death blight. Love it. Oh, good. Oh, good. It conjures giant floating creepy eyes that just deal death blight on sight. Hey, did you think the uh, winter lanterns were bad? How about this? How about death blight eyes? Where is it? Can I sprint that right now or do I have to let it go down? Oh, that's the addition from getting the new resistance, so. Oh, nope, it can see me. I don't have the anti death blight spell equipped right now. Okay. Underneath the safe. Makes creepy sounds. Oh, undead. Oh, that's why I have this. Oh, I see him there. Can I sneak a shot around? Not really. Aha! The wall's not a liar. Left, huh? Can't see him this time. And that's why I have a shield of swords. Wait. Is that death blight still recovering or did I get hit with a new death blight sight? I'm not seeing big creepy eyes. I see you down there. Ha. I missed.
Liar. Yes. Or no? Oh, that one seemed like it went through, but it didn't actually have an invisible wall. Illusory wall. Okay, so that one, like, clinks off, but this one also does. Never mind. I don't know what was going on. Yeah, I see it. That. That. Are you also a liar head? You bet. It's funny because the way ratings kind of work, this one is highly upvoted because, oh no, it's not. By the way, it's at zero, which means there must be a negative one here, which is why it's not showing up. Well, look at that conspicuous trap. First off, right. Oh, it's going to circle around. Oh, is this another ceiling trap? No, I hear... Badness. I hear the badness noise up there. Yeah, there it is. So if I go straight ahead, it'll see me and probably death blight me. Oops. <laughs> oh, look, actual basilisks. Okay, so the eyes didn't see me. They're actually not even active right now. Oh, not yet. All right, Mesmer soldiers. Don't think I don't see that trap there. Actually, oh, I totally could ride that if it went low enough. I mean, that's right there. I see those dudes at the end, but I can just go up here. What is over there anyway? Oh, they're at an altar of something. Hey, so how high does that go and does it crush me? I really don't want to test that, actually. I can't look high enough. Oh, now it's spawned in. Mimicry or visions dashing through. Wait. Does that work? Where are my key items here? If I use Mimic Veil, will I be able to pass through? Because it, like, doesn't see me? What is Mimic Veil under? It's a tool, right? All the way at the bottom? There it is. Does it work? Does it try to death blight me? Is this working? That's insane! That works! Yo! That's amazing. That's the coolest. Alright, and there is in fact space up there, so if it drops down, I can actually climb up on top. But that works! That's... Uh, I never would have guessed. Crossable spot. Excuse me while I slap this on. Alright, so this looks like the way forward, I guess. But there's things to do. I never would have guessed. That does use FP. Oh, now I'm a coffin. Hmm. 
Wow. I never would have guessed Mimic Veil had this kind of ability. To block Death Blight Sight. Granted, that's not really an ability I would have expected to see in general. But... Cool. Oh, well. You know, I don't have a, like, nuke. I realize now. I didn't put on, like, any of my big stuff. I don't have Canada Heim or anything. Ow. Ow. Stop, seriously. Knight's Lightning Spear? One of the incantations of the capital's ancient dragon cult summons a lightning spear while manifest also manifesting ancient dragon crests. On throwing the spear, the crests launch additional spears. This is what the Death Knight was using on me way back when, where he, like, Gate of Babylon me. Charge to increase number of crests and add a bolt of lightning to impact. Yo! Wait, can I use this? 36. I am very close. I need two levels to use this. Knight's Lightning Spear. On my right. Oh, please, that could have hit. Ha. Oh, hi there. Oh, that landed! Ha, you walked into it, stupid. Yellow Fogger Bloom. Alright, but I want to get up there, because I saw a way up there. I have to let the thing come down. And this leads to the elevator. So, like, I need this to come down so I can jump on top of it. How? Where's the nearest way to activate it? Because I gotta stand near enough for it to be like, Oh, that's an enemy. Let me stamp it. Looks like it'd have to be in this corner here. <sighs> it recognizes me as an enemy now. It stopped working because I got too close. Let that drop all the way. Let it activate. Uh oh. Didn't work as well as I'd want it to. You still see me? You still see me? All right. Well, I'm glad I put the thing on so that way I can resist the death blade because that built up a lot. No stop, no stop, no stop, no stop. How many rejuvenating bolts is 12? Probably should have waited. I'm stupid. I jumped far too early. Because I was like, I just need to jump before it comes down and then I'll be able to land on it. But no, that's not the way. That is not the way at all. But I see the path. I just need to do it right. The problem is having the speed to do it correctly. And not panic so hard when it's like. Aha! Did it! Oh. That's what that's for? Okay. Oh, I see there's another path there. Uh. That's safe, right? Safe enough? Yeah. 
Uh, the thing here is... You stupid didn't do the thing, should have jumped. Go. Around the corner. Now I'm up here. It's just glove wart. Not really a precious item. Alright, drop back down. Send faster. Now. Aha, he made it. All right, dude. Hello there. Go down, thank you. Black Knight Captain Hugh. Hugh. Uh, Black Knights were the primary force of Mesmer's army. Second to their knight commander was Hugh, a man with agile command of both twin blade techniques and the powers of the Crucible, whose spirit in these ashes dwells. Though a champion of the Divine Beast Hunt, he followed his father Andreas into a rebellion against Mesmer, and like his father, he too was imprisoned in an under underground tomb. Mesmer mourned the loss of a brother in arms. I guess that explains why when I summon him, he'd want to fight against Mesmer soldiers, because he and I guess his father betrayed Mesmer. Works for me. Alright, now to actually go across the way and, uh, not die. Come on down. Go. Alright. I've been out of sight for a while, so it shouldn't be active when I go up. Like, it should be turned off and not be death staring me now, right? Nope, it's death staring me. Is this gonna work again, or is that over? It's working again. Yeah, I guess only when I get close enough, it's just like, no, that's not real. But right now, it's... I'm, I'm fine. That's crazy. I need to... Well, I can't knock because I left it over there. But that message that said try mimicry. That's... That's a good piece of advice right there. Because I did not expect it to work that well. As in completely. As opposed to not at all. Craziness. Liar. There's no hidden paths back here. Falsehood, Stake of America. Does that mean stage two or boss? Oh no. Well, that's something. I see, when it goes back, I can run across. But, uh, death eyes, huh? Brief respite indeed. Uh, do I drop down then? The eyes don't register as an enemy. Oh, it's not a drop, it's stairs. Oh, I see, and I gotta... Climb back up. Keep bouncing off the walls. All right, not too complex. Very weird. Is there gonna be another one? Range battle and be wary of right. Oh. So don't sprint in. All 
All right. The ceiling is safe. Yeah, I thought so. Oh, it's a big one. I mean, that's not too crazy. I oh, mind flasks. I gotta be more careful with what I shoot. No. You're not as big as the other one, though. You're like the medium one. But don't go for the item because there's Mega Mouth over here. It's not incredible. It's a Grave Glove Wart. Are you a liar? You're a super huge, massive liar. How dare you? I didn't see whatever that was. Oh, that's what that was. Hey! Ah, 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 ah. Okay. Hey, how come I don't get that spell? Oh my god, that tracks from out here? Are you kidding me? What are these super busted death spells that these guys have? That's stupid! That's stupid! Look at the tracking on that! That's nuts! I'm sorry, no! That's going in my book as, no, that's not fair! You just have a... You don't need line of sight for that, and it just tracks? Hey, how come I don't get these spells? Because that's not a death spell. Oh, God. I'm hoping this leads to the dude. It doesn't. Like, how can he just have spells that can track me so hard like that? Where even is he? He didn't see me, because he's stupid. It really is stupid. I don't know what that was. Okay, well, that goes down. Oh, you know what? I think that goes to that room there. I just have to find a way to get across safely. Okay, there's an ambush down there. Go for the ladder. Oh, wait. Right, I came from there. Then I ran this way. I can go take the ladder to go down that way. I'm going to go upstairs first. But I'm like just out of juice. So it looks like I just sprint behind these eyes. Wait a minute. Go back to the bridge. Oh. Could you not? Seriously. Oh my god. What is this frame perfect trap? How can all of those land meaty? Should have rolled here. Fire? What do you mean, fire? This should be safe to take these blades up. That's what you mean by fire. You've got to be kidding me. I win. All right, did this lead to where that sorcerer guy was? There are so many different places to go. Oh, this is where the eyes go normally. Yeah, because I go down the stairs and then I go across that way. And that's where the elevator is. Ancient Dragonite's cookbook. Oh, you turned around. 
All right, uh, this is the ladder I came up from. Uh, just Dragon Ball Grease and Drawstring Dragon Ball Grease. Okay. Grab that. More rejuvenating bolsters, that's good. Uh, those are the same eyes, but there's... How am I missing? Well, that stick of America better be all the way down there when I... Oh, dung, really? Oh, I see, this is the end of the path. Alright. I think I went all the way through, so I just need to... Sprint behind the eyes again. Oh, you see me. Alright, now they turn around. Sprint, don't get too close. And down we go. First off down, and then lift. Why, is there something below the lift? I was just talking about it. Is there gonna be something below? It doesn't look like it. Nope. That's death. Alright, I'm glad they don't require us to open the doors here. Like, find the switch. Death ahead, try holy. Night! I have no flasks. What's gonna happen? But I'll, you know, try holy. Death Knight round two. You have a different axe. Do, does backstabbing work on you too? Missed it. Oh, nope. <laughs> there it is. Alright, now that I have heals though let's actually do this because yeah yeah it was the lack of heals that i was definitely not going to win that oh i don't even have like a good talisman setup right now so i'm still using great jar for no reason uh what do i want to put on what do i have in my flask right now i do want that uh, take these off. I'll leave the rest on. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna use Discs of Light. I think I'm just gonna... power through like normal. Alright, you're gonna immediately open up with lightning again? No, you're gonna open up with that. Oh, well, you're still... There we go, that's what I'm looking for. Couldn't roll. Got stuck. Missed it. Excuse me. Yep, you can input read me, but it's fine. Get a backstab. That's what I was afraid of. That's what I was afraid of. I knew I was going to do it. Really? Aha. Aha. 
Ha-ha! <laughs> 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 yeah, I have your number. I tried to get fancy with it. You've got to be kidding me, dude. You've got to be kidding me! Dude has like two health left and he can't stop moving! Also, he has like infinite poise. I've not been able to get a knockdown on him. I've just been getting backstabs. Oh my god. Missed it. Oh. I can't believe I'm screwing this up this bad. Thank you, jeez. Finish him. There we go. That took everything because I just screwed it up so much. Death Knight's Long Haft Axe and Cerulean Amber Medallion. Long Hafted Golden Axe wielded by the Death Knight bears a representation of a decayed golden ring. Crackles with lightning, the power of the cat capital's ancient dragon cult. The Knight, once the personal guard of Godwin, was also the protector of the Prince of Death's cadaver surrogate. Uh, so it's the same description, but this one has Blink Bolt Long Hafted Axe. So it's another Blink Bolt Bolt, but uh, with the Long Axe version. And this is blue. And there is the surrogate. All right. Pretty much the same as the Dual Axe guy, but, you know, fairly different enough. Different enough that I couldn't quite handle his moveset the same way, but... I mean, mechanically, get behind him, backstab him. Uh, I don't want to go back down to that grace. However, what I will do is... Where was it? It was... Here. Because there are things I missed in here, and I need to remember where I missed them. I know there's the hole in one of the traps, but also let me level up. One more, and I'll be able to use the cool lightning spear. But yeah, let me attempt a quick run-through of this. I walked right into that. Yeah, he gets, like, no poise from that, uh, attack, but he's able to keep looping it. Oh, really? Can I hit him? No. Stop. Thank you. Uh, it was the later trap that had the hole for me to fall into. I walked out without even checking my corners. Oh, did he not die? Hang on. Alright, that'll do too. How did that not hit him? Oh. You want to join the fray? You know what? I commend that. Very cool of you. Pick this up because I can. Uh, right. <laughs> I remember now. Are you gonna drop down like the other one? 
If you do, that'd be super cool. Oh, you did. Oh, how did that angle upward? I cannot dodge this for the life of me. I don't know why I get, like, extra stupid when I, like, have to deal with that one. Uh, is this the one? No, it's not. Is this one I need to activate? This one I wrote already, right? Yeah, this one I need to activate, then drop down behind me. Oh, I was too close. It didn't even do that much damage. It just hurt my pride. Right, and now I gotta go across. And then, oh, it's still down there. <laughs> I gotta pull the lever. And then I can warp out at any time, right? Yeah, because that's still set. All right, now I go back down again. My swords get slightly confused because I'm moving faster than they normally float down. Hi there. Bye there. Alright, there's the guy in that corner. There's also you. You know what? I'm realizing you guys are different because you don't have the big jumpy ones. Can I just run past without aggroing you? Excellent. So I know that's not the way. Is this the room? Yes. Oh my god, it's so annoying. Oh my god, it's so annoying. Hang on. Magic defense. Screw it, just go. All right, I forgot you're here. And then there was the hole in here. Hello, everyone. Rush you. Rush to slime. Fire does better on you than magic. Still works, though. Love wart. <laughs> I want to go home. I came back willingly, so I really have nothing to say. But yeah, I believe fire works better on the sludges here. Oh, yeah. By far. I missed. There we go. Yeah, I can't believe I missed this entire section. Hello. And I guess that's the ladder to go back up, which I didn't find the other side to. Oh, that's what I gotta deal with. Oh, multiple. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. You were waiting there? No, stop. Ah, I did get two for one. Oh, there was a spell here, Electro Charge. Huh. 
that kind of explains all the lightning in the room or the water in the room rather not that one of the incantations of the capital's ancient dragon cult calls down lightning to charge the caster's body while charged electric shocks will strike the area several times charging increases potency the origin of incantations that bolster the lightning body with lightning and now a lost art in the lands between but there's at least two that i have already don't i i know there's two at least i don't remember if i have them uh yeah dragon bolt blessing and vikes dragon bolt they're not lost i already have two of them anyway it's the ladder and then oh where does this lead now because i didn't find the top of this ladder before it's a tall ladder where does this go Where? Oh, it's up here. And that's the room where the dude is. That I'm going to ignore again. And this is the big spiky room. And I have to figure out how to deal with this again. Because he's going to do his shooty stuff, and I hate it. Made it. This guy is his friend in the back who spits fire. Oh, you're not a fire spitting one. All right. And then where's the way to like Is there anything above this one? Oh, there's a room. Well, I found the way in, I guess. Weird. That's different. Ash of War Blink Bolt. Look at that. I missed so much. This is a regular Blink Bolt as opposed to the two Axe ones. Skill used by Golden Knights who serve Godwin from a low stance. Body is transformed into a bolt of lightning and charges straight ahead at fulgur speeds. So it's Thunderstep. I hear stuff dancing around. But if I send this down... Aha, there's a room there. It's like a trampoline. Oh, you move at different speeds. What is... Oh, it's another altar. Like where I got the stone sheath sword. Dark sword fighter. If only I had a light. Ray stone sheath sword to the dark. Oh, did it transform? Sword of darkness pulled from its stone scabbard at an altar. From the quick of the root, wandering coils of darkness coalesce and release, their eddies and vortices giving form to the dark blade. Unique skill, darkness. Raise the sword aloft and cleave surroundings with darkness. Deals holy damage. I guess they don't really have dark damage in this. They don't have dark damage in this game. Huh. I mean, Dark Souls 1 had fire, electric, and magic. There was no holy damage. Uh, like... Dark Moon Blade, which was the holy enchantment, was magic damage. Dark Souls 2 added dark. And I think Dark Souls 3 kept dark, but there's no dark in this game. So I guess it's just negative holy. Deals holy damage and temporarily reduces holy damage negation. Ah. Okay. So, if I came here first, would I have found a stone sheath sword and then the other one would transform it into a dark sword? Or, I guess, light sword, if possible. 
Like, whichever one you get to first gives you the sword, and then any other one will- the other one will transform it. Okay. And look, another ladder. Where does this one go? Do I have health? I do have health. People died here. That's why. Alright. It is super funny that they lose, like, all poise when they're hopping. They get knocked over. Can I please hit this guy? Probably should be using my heavies. And then it's just, this just a drop down. Oh, Jesus! That's really close. <laughs> All right, yeah, that's back over here. Is there a zone above this one? If I go back across, is there going to be a door on the other side? No. This one I don't think I can get on top of, because that looks pretty solidly just nothing. And this goes down to the boss room, so I think I'm done here. That said, I think I'm done... Oh, wow, that took me all the way over here. So, from Fogroof Catacombs, I get over here. And then from Scorpion River Catacombs, I end up, like, also over here? I didn't look at the map. Huh, they're really just right next to each other, just underground. That's kind of neat. But yeah, so I guess I've done... All of this section. And I've revisited this one. So I guess it's time to go back up... And go across the bridge. Zone cleared! Oh, well, I didn't figure out... The ruins. Hang on. Let me... It was... here. I'm gonna figure out what to do, and when I come back, I'm gonna do it so I can get in there, because... I gotta get in there. And I will absolutely cheat, look up advice, to get in there. But yeah! Cleared a catacomb, fought a bear, did stuff. Maybe I should think of a new weapon to use as well. Let me try and quickly decide. Straight swords are neat. I could try dual daggers. I don't know if that'll, that'll be a thing. Uh, I could run black knife and blade of calling just so I can have the double. Oh yeah, black knife does holy damage as well. Even though it's technically death and death and dark. Uh, But maybe not daggers. I could use a great sword. I could use Claymore. Baymore, it's been a while since Dark Souls 1. Oh, I could try Karen Thrusting Sword. Or Sorcery Sword. Run that in a shield and with like Karen spell not yeah, Karen spells. I'll think about it. I could go back to a curved sword. It's been a while for that. Kinda wanna try Omen Cleaver actually. Let me see if I can... Oh, I'm too heavy now, though. What if I went back down to Hoslo? Hoslo's still too heavy. Omen Cleaver is stupidly heavy. Dismounter? Dismounter is fine. Bloodhound Fang is heavy. Xamar Curved Sword, but that's Unique Ash of War. I need one more Arcane to actually use Morgoth's Curved or Cursed Sword. I did like it. Medium load with dismounter. I might give that a shot. Let me... Let me go level it up before I forget. And then I'll go back to the temple and... Then figure out how to do it. Also, what Ash of War do I want on this? Now, the thing is, I like the Omen Cleaver because it looks like a big katana. Granted, we now have great katana, so that's not necessary. But dismounter also looks cool. Reminds me of the Murakumo back in DS1. Old Shiva of the East. Glad I bought all these stones, that way I just have a surplus to upgrade things. Three, twenty-four. What ash do I put on this? I could try running Lion's Claw. Basically, anything that I can just put magic 
inf uh, affinity on. Uh, I could put Swords Dance, which is a fast ash, on this weapon. I just like having my magic stuff, you know, like my magic swords. It's just so weird to me that there's only so many magic arts and three of them are the same. Like, give me magic sword skills. I love the addition of the thrust with um, Glintblade Phalanx. It's so good. It's also on this, but it's so good. It feels so good. But I want more variety. And it just feels so bad that I didn't get any. Uh, I mean, my faith is only 30, only 35. It's still pretty high, but it's definitely not like going to be as strong as if I made it magic. Uh, I don't. Oh, why could I ghost flame call? Make this. Yeah, might as well go cold. Let's see. Does this work like the, uh, what's it called? The death poker. Death's Poker is cool and all, and its Ash of War is very good. Its skill is very good, rather. But I don't like the design. Kaboom. Light. Trail. Explosion. Okay, so that is exactly like... Um, the... Curved Sword. The... Death's Poker is the name of the weapon. So, I don't know how it is power-wise, because Ashes of War tend to be very different from unique skills. But, you know, maybe it'll be good. Maybe it won't. I just know Death's Poker is very good, so I'm hoping this performs more or less similarly. Anyway, new weapon in hand. I am still medium load. Uh... I do want that powered up. This doesn't have weight to it, right? I can take it off now. Doesn't have weight, but still. Great that it worked. That was amazing that I could just sneak past with that. Anyway. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna figure out these ruins. And then I'll head up across the bridge. When we come back. Next time. <laughs>